Armstrong, didn't see you there. We're just out here enjoying this lovely holiday weather. We got a warm show today that'll be sure to get you in the holiday spirit. What's up guys, it's Team Young Vision, and we're gonna take on some of the top Nordic skiers around. <laughs> <laughs> We got this. How do you know though? We lose everything. Don't say that. Everything. Don't say that. All right. Name one challenge you've won. I can't, all right? But we have an opportunity right now to redeem ourselves, all right? Finish it up, man. Finish strong, Papa. <laughs> Crawl on me, baby. Crawl right here. Get to right here. I can't do it. Get to right here, Papa. Nice race. Nice race. race. There you go. I saw your heart, man. Your heart wanted to win. You know what? I saw yours too, man. Good job. Thanks, man. Good job. Mic check. One, two, three. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just talking. Josh Hernandez. Uh, not as much as it used to be back in the old days. I'd say once a month, maybe. Bacon. Oh, me, by an order of magnitude. Uh, I'm gonna go with Ryan Summers. Something about the head. Oh, got a little hot outside, so uh, we decided to come back in and cool off. This week, Papa has the opportunity to interview some of the most important people in our building. People that without, you'd go hungry. Hey Armstrong, I'm here with the most wonderful woman on the planet, the Armstrong Lunch Lady. Hi, I'm Sue and I like serving the hamburgers and hot dogs. Barb Zeman and I like serving cheesy bread. Pam Brands. Lasagna. Ann Johnson and mandarin chicken. Vicki Gasparini and my favorite lunch is mandarin orange chicken. Dawn Ross and I like Bosco cheese sticks. Sandy Munger and I like chicken Alfredo. A lot of students have been wondering, do you guys live in the kitchen? Do we live in the kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it feels like we do, <laughs> but no we do not. What's the biggest megabyte serving you've seen a kid get? 17. No, me. no, 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 one yes, person, one person. Yes, one person bought 17 oh, pizzas. Right. That, that was yeah. last year. Oh, 17 pizzas? He wanted to close his account out. 17? <laughs> 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 17? Yeah. 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 
17. Well, Gee whiz, seven. did he eat them all? I was like, go for it, you can eat it. <laughs> what percent of the kids say thank you? Oh, I would say 50%, 60. You give them a little extra something, something they do? No, we're not supposed to. <laughs> they, they, the, they were told by the district how, many, how much we can give out of each thing, so that's one reason why sometimes it looks like less work. They give us quantities of how much we can only give of each item without having to give extras. Is there any corporal punishment if you do give a higher serving size? Yeah, it feels like <laughs> it Have you ever been in the time. kitchen? There's like this metal plate in the floor. Yeah, it's where we put lower them into. <laughs> where the old, all the ladies, when all of a sudden they're gone. <laughs> they shave your head if you do. Yeah. <laughs> What were you guys' childhood dream jobs? I think a lot of us um, grew up raising our children at home and, and then this job is so perfect for raising a family because you get your kids off to school, you go to work and you can be home um, by the time your kids get home. Let's play the counting game, guys. We gotta count to 20 and if you repeat the same number, we gotta start over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, <laughs> 13, <laughs> 14, 15. Oh! <laughs>